National Hero Day. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, local man has transformed his home into a Halloween wonderland. And Molly is live in Roseville this morning, meeting, meeting Dan the Pumpkin Man and getting a tour of his incredible display. Wow. Hey, Molly. This guy is talented. Yeah, I do have, I have a very important question for you guys. Okay. Do you know the Pumpkin Man? The Pumpkin Man? The Pumpkin Man. Do you know the Pumpkin Man? Mm. Who lives on Greenwood Court? Well, I know the Pumpkin Man. It's Dan, Roseville's wow. own Pumpkin Man, uh, who has more than 300 hand-carved pumpkins out on display, not just for your entertainment, but for a good cause. Now, Dan, Whoa. let's start from the beginning. How did this all start? Well, it started uh, back in 2010 for my son's first Halloween with two pumpkins, and then it kept growing every single year. And as we rolled up, obviously, once you get here, you can't miss the display. Uh, my photog right here, Mark Willis, asked, you got to ask how he keeps these all uh, fresh, how they don't rot. Well, here's the answer. They're, they're foam. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, I don't have that much free time in the day. So uh, when it really comes down to it, uh, using the foam ones, I can just add every year and make the display even bigger. Yeah. And you guys, speaking of ones look he made us our very own good day sacramento pumpkin how cool is that so cool. now let's come over here and look at a few more because all of these i mean you really can't spend enough time here everyone like triggers a memory or some kind of nostalgia ducktails ooh, right <laughs> uh, so people must just come and i mean spend an hour here just looking around yeah, you'd be surprised at how many people look through and as I'm talking with them have different suggestions. And I'm like, oh, we've got that one over there or over there. So I have to show you guys. Look at this. He made. Oh, where did Barbie go? Where, where oh, did, there it is. Hi, Barbie. He made Barbie. He made Barbie last year and he said uh, maybe he's going to work on some Kennergy pumpkins oh, uh, for, for this season Ken. as well. Uh, something important. There's no Barbie. Don't forget Ken. Ken. Do not forget Ken. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so you do a really good thing with this pumpkin display with all the people who come and see it. You you ask to raise funds for the Placer County Food Bank. Yes. So since uh, 2020, we've uh, taken donations for the Placer County Food Bank. And last year we were able to raise about thirteen hundred dollars, which is about uh, uh, 13,000 meals for people in need. Which is incredible. And if people donate five dollars, they could end up with their own pumpkin. Yes, so at the end of the year, we uh, have a drawing for every $5 you donate, you get entered into the raffle, and you could win your own custom pumpkin carved by me. I love it. Now, you guys, he also takes suggestions. If there is a pumpkin out here that you would like to see, uh, Tina, Jordan, any suggestions? Uh, does he have a killer clown pumpkin? Honeybees. Do you have a killer clown pumpkin? Oh, he okay. has Pennywise, but not okay, a killer no, that You counts. want a scare? Of course, you want a scary pumpkin? <laughs> well, Tina him? doesn't want a scary Look at all pumpkin. These friendly. Tina suggests hun what honeybees? Okay. Honeybees, please. Killer clown. Do you have any honeybees? Honeybees. Oh, okay, that's Dan. One. We've got two. We've got two suggestions right in there. Mm -hmm. And Dan, I asked what your neighbors think about this. They said, you said they love it. So uh, we can welcome people. We can invite people to come out to Greenwood Circle in Roseville so that you can come experience this spectacular display of pumpkins. Maybe chip in a, a $5, uh, feed a few people in need this Halloween season. But how incredible, how incredible is this? The That's detail, great. it's something you should really come see in person. Uh, fun for literally, there's something for every single person out there to come see and enjoy. Way to go. Thank you. You're going to have to Wonderful. teach me how to do this someday. <laughs> it's very talented. We'll send it back to you guys from Dan Dan, the Pumpkin Man. All right. Thank you, Molly. Sounds good. He lives on Greenwood Circle. <laughs> Thank you.